So today I'm going to sing for you a song called The uh, Three Neurotransmitters. It's a song I recently wrote that's part of a series of songs on neuroscience. Last fall I brought you the neurodevelopment song, a couple months ago it was the mirror neuron song, and today it's The Three Neurotransmitters. These songs were inspired by a workshop I went to last fall called Linking Neuroscience to Clinical Practice. The facilitator uh, was Dr. Martha Burns, a speech-language pathologist in the Chicago area. And Dr. Burns did such a beautiful job of making the very complex topic of neuroscience easy to understand and functional for the clinician. I was really inspired after her workshop and so I decided to kind of help um, both share this information with others and to also solidify it in, in my own mind, turn some of these topics and, and things like that into song. So, uh, hence the, this series and hence this song, The Three Neurotransmitters. Little disclaimer, there are more than three neurotransmitters, but these are the three that she emphasized in the workshop and so therefore they're the three I'm bringing to you. Brain undergoes tremendous change in the first three years of life. After this, you're pretty much set, which is why you want to start out right. But our brains reorganize and change. It's called neuroplasticity. This works due to certain chemicals, namely these three. Our brain, it changes because of neurotransmitters. They help reorganize and change our brain's parameters. There's norepinephrine and acetylcholine, also dopamine, the three neurotransmitters. The alerting network tells us to pay attention, uses norepinephrine to drive connections. Starting in the locus coruleus, it alerts us to the stimulus. Use novelty key for each of us to release norepinephrine. The orienting network starts in the basal forebrain, enhances our focus with acetylcholine. Uses arousal and reward. Don't let the work be a chore. Make it motivating, interesting. Don't be a bore to release acetylcholine. The executive network is like a safe button. Uses dopamine, which rewards and punishes. If you want to retain new information, it helps to have some motivation. Keep reinforcing the situation to release the dopamine. So now you know about neurotransmitters and how you can use them to change brain parameters. They help us pay attention to focus our intentions and respond to motivation. The 